Hi YouTube, I just wanted to do a, a quick silver and gold unboxing. So this is the result of a flip that my son did. Um, he was ba he basically realized um, right from the start of the Zombuck series he was buying two of each round and he realized uh, this fall that he was having trouble keeping up buying both so he only wanted to buy one and since he was only buying one of each um, he wanted to uh, sell what he had and so let's see what he chose to get with the proceeds so he actually did okay with this let me know what you think let me make sure there's no paperwork in here there should be uh, the old package within a package He was pretty excited about the results of this, um, and I let him choose what he wanted to get. Yeah, I'm just trying to get the invoice out of here. All right, so let's pull everything out of here. All right, so this is number one. He got the one tenth ounce gold kangaroo, the Kanga Moon. Now. Honestly, uh, of all the Perth designs, and I'm thinking about the major ones, the Kookaburra, the, uh, the Lunars, um, this is honestly my favorite design of all the new ones. I, I just think it's incredible. I'd definitely love to get a larger size for myself, and I, can, I could see that happening at some point this year. That's the thing about the Boolean Strikes, uh, well, not the Boolean Strikes, but the, uh, the, the Boolean with the unlimited mintage is you had all year to... Uh, make the purchase. It's not like you get a quick sellout. So this is pretty cool. This is basically his first um, gold that he's bought for himself. Uh, we've gotten him a tenth of an ounce for the last two Christmases. So this is up, he's up to three tenths of an ounce now. But this is the first one that he's bought. So basically he put $100 into the Zombucks rounds and he was able to buy himself a, a one tenth ounce piece of gold. And that looks tiny. He was able to partially pay for the feast dollar, um, so I mean, not not too bad on his part. He just had to put in an extra fifteen dollars for the feast dollar. So, and then what did my daughter get? She was she wanted to get a feast dollar as well. So the two of them kept the zombux going. She has a couple of these. And the copper, uh, you know, I, I'm not a big uh, proponent of buying copper rounds, okay? Uh, but, you know, this is something that, you know, he is putting both the silver and copper together. And in all honesty, you know, if you look at what the Zombox sell for, if you combine the copper with the silver, it does uh, get a little bit more of a premium, so... That's it, guys. That is the result of a successful flip in my book. I think it was pretty successful. I was pretty uh, happy with it. Doesn't replace hard work. I made sure to uh, get that across to him. That yeah, it's great to to do something like this and have it work out well. But it doesn't replace uh, working hard. But I'm pretty psyched about this one right here. Pretty awesome stuff. All right, guys, it's good to talk to you, and uh, my hope is I've got the next couple of days off. I hope to get a couple of videos out, so I'll talk to you later.